Hey everyone, welcome on the Stack channel. So in the last video of this series, we added this emoji picker on our Flutter chat app. Now in this video, we have to work on this attachment part. So when you click on this attachment button, a pop-up will come. So we have to make this functionality in this video. So at the last of this video, after you click on this button, a pop-up will come with the different kind of the option as like as the WhatsApp one. So please watch the video till the last and hit the like button and subscribe button. And now let's begin the code. Now we have to work on this icon button of the attachment file. Here is the code of the icon button of the attachment file and here we have the on place method. Here we have to write the logic. So here to get this kind of view, we need to use the show model bottom seat method provided by the flutter. So let me use it. So when a person will click on this attachment file button, then it will render a show model bottom seat. Inside here, in a context, we have to provide the context and builder will take a builder method. So let me provide a builder property and it will return a custom widget. Let me create a new custom widget. To create a new custom widget, I will go in the end of the code and I am going to create a new method which will return a widget. The name of the method will be bottom seat. The name can be anything and it will return container. Okay. Okay. I did a mistake. I think container spelling is wrong. Let me just rectify it. Container. Okay. So at this point of time, it is returning a empty container. So let me just return a container from the builder method. Okay. So here, as you can see, so model bottom seat will returning a custom widget. So we have to work on this custom widget to get this kind of view. So let us start the coding. But before I'm going to hit the save and show you that how it will look like if I will click on attachment button. Here it is a model and the model is not looking like the UI which we want. So let's work on it. So I will go on a bottom seat method which I created and it is running a container. Let me provide the height of the container to 278. Also we have to provide the width of the container. I'm going to use the media query to get the width of the screen. And at the last, in the child, I'm going to return a card. So in the card, let me just provide the margin first. I'm going to use the edge inset dot all and the margin will be 18. And we will just do the setup of the margin. If I will hit the save and uh, you can find that the height of the model is reduced but we are not able to see the our card to see the card we have to use uh, another property of the show model bottom seat that we have the background property and let me provide the background of the show model bottom seat to transparent and if i will hit the save and let me just click outside of the so model bottom seat and if I will again click on a button then you can see that we are able to see our card now we have to put all of the icon on this card so here you can see that we have six icon document camera gallery audio location and contact to, if you see the view then you will find that we are going to use the column inside the column we have the children's and the column will return the row. So here we have two column, first one, second one, and here we have the three rows, one, two, three. So if I will make this thing happen, so we have to use the column in our card. So let me just use the column first, and you will get to know once I will create it. So I'm going to use the 
child column widget and inside the column widget i'm going to use the children and the first children will be row okay and you also have the children property and for the icon this icon and text i'm going to create a new method so let me first create a method that the method will return a widget and it will be icon creation name and it will gonna return a column widget why you can see it over here that first we have a icon then we have the text this can we achieve using the column widget only so inside the column widget we will use the children and the first children will be circle or tar to get this kind of view okay inside the circle or tar we have to set the radius i'm going to use a radius to 30 the second thing we have to provide is the child let me use the child as the icon because all of all of the thing we have here is the icons so here in the icon we have to provide the icon name and we can provide using the icons dot we can use any kind of icon so let me use this icon the name of this icon is the insert drive file so icon also have a property of size so let me use this size to 29 and let me just use this icon creation method in a bottom seat so on the column widget our first children is the row and in the first children of the row i'm going to use this icon creation and let's begin the journey and let me hit the save then you will see the changes the first icon is added it is the icon of the document now the second thing inside the icon creation method I'm going to use I mean just after the circle author I'm going to use the text widget the text will be document and I'm going to hit the save you can see that the document icon and the text is came here now let's customize it in a icon creation method I am going to take three parameters first one is type of the icon data which kind of icon we are going to use the second parameter i'm going to use that the background color of the circle avatar that what will be the background color of this circle avatar so for that i'm going to use the color the parameter name will be also a color and the third thing will be the text property that what will be the text of the icon so for that i'm going to use the string and it will be a text now let me just use this thing over here instead of using the icons dot insert drive file i'm going to use the icon provided by the method so this icon i applied here and the color we have to say it here in the circle avatar one the circle avatar have the property of the background color and this color which i will get from the method i'm going to assign here and the last one is text we have to use text over here okay now we customize the icon creation method so we have to pass all these three variable inside this icon creation method so let me pass for the first icon the first icon will be icons dot insert drive file and the color of this icon will be colors dot indigo and the text will be 
document and let me hit the save the color is changed and also inside the icon creation inside the icon let me use the color of the icon because the color is dull here so icon have a property called color let me use the color of the icon to colors dot white and hit the save now the color is also added and let me just copy this thing okay because we have the three icon in a row one two and three let me hit the save three icon is added and uh, let me change the icons name the second icon will be the camera alt let me change the color of the camera alt to pink and the last we have to change the name of the icon same thing we have to do for the third icon and the third icon will be a uh, insert photo we have to change the color of the icon the color will be purple and it will be a gallery hit the save and see the changes all the icon are added but it's not looking good we have to add some padding between them so let me add the padding between them i'm going to add a size box of width 40 between the all the icon i'm going to hit the save and see the changes now the padding is added but still it is not looking good to look good we have to use the main axis alignment of the row to the main axis alignment center hit the save and see the changes now the three icon is added but still we need the padding between this icon and the top of this thing to do that what we have to do just let me wrap this i this column widget to the padding widget and provide me padding between them i'm going to use the symmetric padding and i'm going to provide the horizontal to 10 and the vertical to 20. let me hit the save and see the changes now the padding is also added but we have to add some padding between this icon between this text let me go on icon creation method and between the circle or tar and text let me provide the size box of height 5 and let me the save again now the padding between the icon is and text is added let me provide some style to this text i'm going to use the text style for it and in the text style let me provide the font size what will the font size let me provide the font size to 12. let me hit the save now it's looking great and now let me add the all other three icon just after the document and camera we need three icon as well audio location and contact let me add those thing so for that what i am going to do just i'm just copying this row widget again because again we have three icon and i'm just going to change the icon name color and the document that's why i created this icon creation method because i don't want to use the same code again and again instead of these i just created a method and i'm just going to use the method again and again so let me just paste the code and let me hit the save of course and let me just provide the padding between these two row size box i'm going to use again the size box height will be the 30 and i'm going to hit the save and let me just change the icon name 
what will be the icon of the audio it is the icon name is the headset what will be the color the color will be the orange and let me just use the document to audio and uh, the second icon of the second row will be location pin okay location pin let me use the name location and the third icon will be the person i mean the contact the color will be blue and the name will be contact and let me hit the save okay now we added all the six icon so if i will click just after the model then the model will automatically gone and if i will again click on a icon button of the attachment file it will come again all the things are added but one thing is not done that we have to make this icon clickable so to achieve those things what we have to do so in icon creation i am returning a column so instead of returning a column let me wrap this widget with the ink wheel and inside the ink wheel we have the on tap property that will take a empty method so the icon are now clickable i am just forgot to change the color of this icon let me change the color of the location pin to the till and now the purpose of this video is completed we added all the icon and also we made this icons clickable so let's meet on the next video but before moving the next video please don't forget to like subscribe and share the video thank you all and happy coding see you on a next video